was a little kid, I loved the movie Gremlins. Still do. It's an awesome flick, and if you've never seen it, you should really check it out. But when I was a kid, I was really into it, so much so that it made me seek out all the Gremlins-like movies that came out after it. Movies like Munchies and Critters and even Ghoulies. So what is it about a cheaply made Euro horror movie that would appeal to a ten-year-old kid? Well, holy hell, just look at that poster. It's a mutant Cabbage Patch doll wearing a little outfit coming out of a toilet. This movie was going to be the shit. I mean, look at that fucker going to bite someone in the ass and all. That's horror comedy gold to a ten-year-old. Well, as I quickly learned back then, and then again now re-watching this thing, Ghoulies is a total crap fest. It's your standard boy inherits house from dead cultist parents and is mysteriously compelled to become an evil priest and summon monsters once he cleans up his basement movie. He alienates his girlfriend with all his goofy chanting, conjures up some ghoulies and then some midgets, and then he throws a dinner party where someone says the secret word and they all scream. But none of that matters, right? Because you know that Ghoulie is just going to come right out of the toilet soon and bite some ass, am I right? Well, before you can get anywhere near that, you got to sit through this. They call me Dick, but you can call me Dick. And this. And then there's this guy. Wait, did he just throw like a sparkler or something? Is that supposed to be badass? I don't know. I'm not scared by that. But finally, ghoulies start popping up out of things, and you know it's coming, and you know it's coming, and then, yeah, there it is! And, wow, that was it? Two seconds? That's all? That just showcases the big problem with this film. You've got these kind of cool ghoulies puppet characters, and they just don't do anything in the film. The movie just isn't about them. They're just props. Ghoulies definitely qualifies, though, as a so-bad-it's-good movie. The films I've reviewed so far in this series have just been dull. But this one sucks so hard, it's fun to watch with your buddies and just laugh at it. So, yeah, there's that. I'm Chuck Dowling, and this has been one of 31 horror movies I'll be watching this October.